also got Until Dawn PS5 performance versus Fidelity graphics comparisons. We got two video. Guys, I am Cal, and in this video we are. What's up, gaming Cal? What's up? Of PS5 performance and the PS5 Fidelity. All right. PS5 Fidelity detailing are so realistic in this game. Even the little detailing and background looks is really good. PS5 performance graphics is looking really great in this game because yeah. the lightning and detailing are look so good. The game okay. models in PS5 Fidelity looks amazing. As you see, the face detailing are really clear, and the character looks just great. Performance game models have same detailing like Fidelity, and the character face detailing is also really good. As you see, Fidelity colors are looking really great in this game. Plus, the saturation are just perfect in the PS5 Fidelity. PS5 performance colors is just perfect. As you see, the lightning and colors are perfectly balanced, and the saturation looks so good in performance. I, I'm gonna give PS5 my own take out, like uh, about this after. Are also very high, and the background detailing are also looking same as PS5 fidelity. What's your thoughts about this PS5 fidelity and performance comparison? Tell okay. me in the comment section. Hope right. you like this video. Subscribe our channel for more. I will meet you in my next video. Till then, goodbye. All right, well, shout out to Gaming Cal uh, for that one. Now, let me explain something to you because I, I think a lot of people don't really understand like the, uh, the, like the difference between performance and fidelity. So for PS5, um, and usually whenever, like, um, and I, bro, obviously the PS5 came out, what, three, four years ago. Uh, and so whenever you play, like, a game on a PS5, there's, like, this setting in the settings, and it says performance or fidelity. Basically what that means is, and I'm going to break this down like we're in chemistry class, basically... If you go towards the performance, if you click performance, if, if you want to do that performance way, then most likely then everything, everything gameplay wise will be on par, such as like the frame. Yeah, such as like the frame rate, such as like the um, such as like the uh, like like the movement, there'll be like no lag, there'll be like nothing, there'll be like no um, there'll be like nothing on the performance side of the game, you know, so like there'll be like no lag issues, no, uh, I think like no frame drops or whatever. Uh, it, because it's for the performance. So now, like, everything in the PS5 is working towards the performance of the game. It's not really focused on the graphics of the game. Fidelity is the looks, the graphics, the coloring, the saturation, the everything, the everything on the visual side of the game. So it's basically, for simpler terms, it's basically, um, it, it's basically, uh, the tech or the, the visual, basically. Now, some people, well, here's the thing. Most people will most likely go towards performance because depending on the game you play, so let's say, for instance, uh, God of War. If you play God of War, I think that you most likely, I think most people, I'll probably say out of a, out of like 100%, I'll probably say 80% of people will most likely pick performance because they don't want to lag. They don't want to, you know, they don't want frames to drop. They don't want to like, you know, they don't want the game to be stuttering and stuff like that. Um, some people will pick fidelity you know so the so the uh game can pop more if you have like a really good monitor you know you want the game to look absolutely beautiful here's the thing though i feel like whenever it comes to uh single player games i think for i think fidelity is the way to go even though some people and again this is a here's the thing the game will work on both sides of the coin okay the game will still work it's not like okay if i if i pick fidelity whenever i'm playing god of war um the game's gonna start stunning whenever no it's just like it's just it might chop up a little bit but the game will look absolutely beautiful uh because now the ps5 is working specifically for the visual instead of like you know the technical around it but if you go towards a performance then the gameplay will be super smooth there'll be no lags there'll be no choppiness there'll be nothing yes uh but the downside is like you know it, it won't pop as much as the fidelity you get what i'm saying so um, and I think a lot of people, uh, here's the thing, a lot of people, they don't really care about the game popping that much. The game, again, the game still looks good whenever, you know, if you, if you pick a uh, performance or not. Um, and this is why I say probably like if you were to, if I was to put like a whole chart around this, I'll probably say out of a hundred percent, 80% of people on most of these PS5 games will most likely pick performance, you know, because performance is, you know, the game will run really nice, especially if you're playing a multiplayer game, bro, and you're playing on the PS5, bro. Yeah, a lot of people are going to play, you know, a lot of people are going to, like, use the performance uh, side of it, you know, because, you know, who wouldn't want the best performance when playing, like, a multiplayer game or or just any game just in general, you know? So, um, you can definitely see the difference between, um, you know, you, here's the thing, though. If you really want to see, like, the, like, a, like the difference, pop in a single-player game, bro, just like uh, Until Dawn, just like God of War, uh, just like, I don't know, like The Last of Us or whatever, 
and you will see the difference between like the fidelity and performance you know um this, like for multiplayer i mean um so let's say um for instance call of duty warzone um yeah cool it'll look great and i mean and yes the, does the call of duty you know um does the call of duty visual settings help yes obviously like those are settings for the game which you know it, it, it's very like it's so simple but at the same time it's very complex because again it depends on the game that you have but also it depends on the settings within that game and stuff like that it's a bunch of like mental gymnastics but uh if you really want to see the difference between performance and fidelity bro pop in a single player game like until dawn like god of war um and, and you will definitely see the difference between performance and fidelity um what i would choose here's the thing if I'm playing a multiplayer game, I would choose performance. If I'm here's the thing, right? Because for me, I love playing single player games on a big TV. I don't know what that is, and maybe that's just me or whatever. But bro, I love playing like really, like really, like um, like single player games on a big TV, whatever. So I will most likely pick fidelity uh, over performance. But but for some games, I do pick performance over fidelity. You know, it, it's very like it's very like a switch swap, whatever it comes to those two. But for the PS5 Pro, bro, you don't, you know, this this won't even be a thing. This is why I kind of hope uh, that the, that Until Dawn will be on the PS5 Pro because if it is on the PS5 Pro, there is no oh you get to choose between performance and fidelity. No, you get the best of both worlds. You get to have uh, both fidelity and performance. You get the you get to have uh, both the performance and the graphics. You get what I'm saying? So this is why, bro, like I. And I understand. I know, like, the PS5 Pro, man, that's, like, <laughs> it's, like, $700. I know a lot of people can't really afford that right now. Um, I mean, obviously, bro, a lot of people are going to get, gonna, you know, get the PS5 Pro. But, um, but yeah, like, the, the fact that we don't have to choose between, you know, performance or graphics anymore. We can have both, like, the best of both worlds is absolutely crazy. Um, speaking of Until Dawn, by the way, we got a lot of Until Dawn videos coming later today. Um, and, and bro, man, make sure you guys like the video, subscribe to the channel, and, and bro, and stay tuned because I'm really excited to see uh, Until Dawn on the PlayStation 5, and hopefully it's on the PS5 Pro. I, I think the PS5 Pro, um, I believe the PS5 Pro comes out in November, I think, or yeah, I think it comes out in November. So, other than that, man, I'm excited. Um, <laughs> Other than that, listen, listen, I'm excited to like, you know, to see all the deaths and stuff at the end of this game. I did hear that it, that there's a secret ending. I haven't watched it yet. Obviously, you guys, are, you, listen, you're going to get our fresh, listen, we're going to get our fresh new reaction to the secret scene that everybody's talking about right now. Uh, and it has to do something with Josh. So um, best believe I got all the videos set and ready. We're going to be covering on, um, we're going to be covering on until dawn for about what, for about what, four I don't know for about three to four days um and then we got dragon ball um the bullet to catch i'm sorry my bad dragon ball sparkling zero uh in about four to five days so everything is working out right now hopefully you, listen i'm excited i'm bro 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 i'm excited right now to cover until dawn for the ps5 um hopefully you guys will be able to subscribe to channel like the video and comment down below man uh your thoughts on the whole performance and fidelity thing but again with the ps5 pro this won't be a thing anymore you have the best of both worlds so and listen i'm not a i'm not a salesman for the ps5 pro okay i don't, don't want to come off as a guy saying hey go get the console no i'm just telling you like the facts or whatever like for the ps5 pro bro there won't be a dip there won't be like a like a choice or whatever you can have like literally the performance and the fidelity i know i sound like a listen i sound like a salesman right now for the ps5 pro but um i'm just keeping it real so um if you guys like the video subscribe to the channel if you guys are new and